Okay, so this is what's going on. Got some new rocker covers, uh, very nice, but they don't have a splash shield for the PCV takeoff, which should be just air, which goes down a hose and back in underneath the air box there, back in there. Um, and it doesn't have a spout for the oil filler cap. It just goes straight in flush. Now what's happening is oil is going through the breather holes and spraying out. Bit of foam mm, sort of does the job to stop that. But this, so I've got two problems here. One, as you can see, I've split the uh, plastic grommet. So there's oil leaking out of there anyway. But also, you can see there's a collection, there's pretty much a puddle of oil down here um, where it's all just leaking out of this pipe. Um, as you can see, it's also leaking out the side of the air box and going into the carbs, so I'm burning oil. That might be the blue smoke coming out of um, the oil cap as well because um, there's a lot of oil in there coming out of this tube. Options weld a splash guard on the inside but i've been told that will take all the paint off the back the sides um i could put a fuel catch tank in a break in this hose somewhere so it catches the, uh, the oil sorry oil catch tank um before it feeds the air back into the air box or don't even feed the air back into the air box put like an air filter on here and just so it can breathe. Um, or I could drill a couple of holes in the rocker cover here and here and rivet um, half a baked bean tin like that with a hole at the top so it shields the hole. Now, I don't know if that would work, whether it's literally the oil being splashed through the valve, the PCV valve and up the pipe, or whether... Um, the, air, the oil turns into like a mist inside there and it will just, even if I've put a splash guard on it, the mist will still go up the tube. I don't know. So just need a little bit of thinking around that and figuring out what to do. But it is actually losing quite a bit of oil. This side mainly, not so much that side now with the little bit of foam underneath the filler cap, but um, this side definitely uh, still leaking a lot from the broken grommet and also from there and just collecting on the top of the engine as you can see and then leaking all the way down the back as well. Let me know what you think.